mommies and daddies this is Meera Rawal signing in from Dreamcatcher Meera in today's video I'm going to show you how I bathe my little son Vivan and this is exactly what I do since he was born initially when he had the umbilical cord I used to sponge him but after the umbilical cord has shut off I bathe the same way as I am going to show you in this video so so if you're a new mom or a mom-to-be and you have queries how you will manage yourself single-handed to bathe your child then this video is for you watch this video till the end and see how i bathe my little son v1 single-handed if you're new to this channel let me tell you these videos are on solely based on my motherhood experience so if you're keen about that and if you're also anxious because you are a new mom then consider subscribing because you will have a lot of fun and you will definitely find that my channel is helpful so if you are a new mom or mom to be and you have queries about different things like how to bathe your baby how to dress your baby how to make food for your babies how to wean your baby or how to start with solid foods or 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 and different many things then do consider subscribing my channel because here is the right information that you will get from my experience if at all you think that my experience has helped you out please write in the comment section and that will motivates me the most and i would love to answer all your comments if you have any queries so for now watch this video till the end how i bathe my son v1 single-handed let's get started You have to make sure that the temperature is uh, the baby temperature that is around 37.5 degrees. This is a thermometer that I use uh, to monitor the temperature in the baby one. Right, baby. This makes it so easy for me to make him bath single handed because of this sit in the baby towel where he can sit and relax and I can do my stuff and V1 enjoys bathing right playing with water in it this is his most favorite thing he loves to sit in water during massage this is also the place where you need to communicate with your baby make him comfortable uh, so that they don't get fuzzy many child children cry during bathing at that time parents forget to communicate with their baby so it makes even more harder to bathe their babies because they are so interactive even if they cannot speak they want the full attention and this communication so that the parents can be the most lovable part of their life and another hand Now 
Now comes the back area. For the back area, you need to hold your baby from the neck and more. Make it forward. If you have this set, if you have this part as an additional, you don't need to worry because they have a support over here and your baby will not fall. So you can easily do and then You need to be careful that the shampoo, baby shampoo and the water does not grip inside the ears. So always give a support with your another hand to the neck area. Change your hands according to requirement but don't forget to give the support to the neck. Another hand. face part at the end remember the eyes of the baby will always be open so rub the face around the eyes the nose and then quickly with the head help of both the ends from outside to inside Finally, drape your baby so that he can just see and the entire body is covered. Hi! Always dry the head part first. Hey, turn around. Good boy.
Oh, <laughs> oh.